Hey guys, it's your girl Kiri. I'm back with another video. Today is going to be a day in the life vlog. I have an appointment to go to to check on myself as well as baby boy. And I want to take you guys with me. I hope you all are happy, healthy, and well. And just come along with me for this journey. All right, guys. Hopefully you can see me. Okay, there we go. But I want to, I just want to have like a little chat on my way there. I don't have a camera mount yet in the car. But um, hopefully it stays. I want it to stay. But anyway, I just wanted to talk about, like, I've been noticing, like, everybody thinks, like, everything has to be so aesthetically pleasing when, like, that's not realistic. Like, I understand, you know, everybody have, like, everybody has a desire to live that aesthetically pleasing life and, you know, this, that, and the third. But you have to understand, like, you have to crawl before you walk. Like, it's just not realistic. Everybody doesn't live like that. And I know oftentimes... You know, sometimes you might envy someone or just find yourself like desiring something that someone have all because you can see it. Um, you know, and I watch like a lot of young ladies who do. I'll say some have, you know, live a realistic life and some do the little aesthetics and everything, but that's, I just know that, sorry, I hope my camera don't fall. I just know that it's very trendy right now. And I just want to say like, girl on this channel, I don't live that. like. You have to be realistic with yourself and you have to be realistic. Alright guys, I'm back. I finally made it to the doctor. I'm here waiting. My appointment is at 2.30. And it is 150. Okay. So yeah, like I was saying, guys. Sorry. Like I was saying, like everything is not gonna be aesthetically pleasing. Like just because you don't have those type of things, don't mean you shouldn't put out the content. You get what I'm saying? Cause like, girl, it's just not realistic. Like you gotta realize, like all of the people who have those things now. Like they've worked hard to get there and I just feel like it's just a false narrative that people have. Like you have to have this, that, and the third to, excuse me, you have to have this, that, and the third to put out this or you have to have, all you have to do is be yourself. Excuse me, everybody's not meant to, everybody not meant to have everything, you know? So it's okay if you don't, girl, just start like, I don't understand why that's such a big thing these days. Like, I really don't get it. Like, just put out the content. Like, and it's all starting to look the same. Like, I don't know. It's all looking the same to me. Like, you know, you gotta put the camera in five different angles just to, girl, <laughs> ain't nobody doing all that. I ain't saying don't do it. And if you do do it, good for you. But that's not what happened over here on this channel. Like. Be yourself, be realistic, be truthful, and just, you know, put out the video, like, or the content, even the pictures, like, I don't know, it's just, we in a new, we living in new times right now. Like, everybody acting like they have to have everything together. And I was watching, um, Erica J TikTok, <laughs> and she was like, she tired of seeing it. She was like, that's why she like TikTok, because instagram like all of the content just look the same and that's just the world that we living in right now girl like period so i just wanted to say that and i want to let you guys know that and i just i love talking to you guys and i just wanted to let you know like sis let's just be real with ourselves and let's just do what we got to do post what we need to post get the videos out there it's really consistency it ain't about where you live or all of that like you have to think about people started from the bottom and I think that's what we fail to realize it's like you didn't see the sacrifices but you see the success and now um you didn't see the sacrifice all you see is the success so when it's like that it's easy for you to think like somebody had it all together when they probably didn't like you just missed out on the time and that's why with me 
I want you guys to grow with me. I take you along with me because I want you to see, you know, God's grace and favor over my life through this journey. You know, it's a lot of people who we watch now, they're already, they're already, um, you know, successful. So that's what we see. But you don't see like the come up. Like Diara, for example, we all love Diara, especially me. Like me and Diara is the same age. We literally grew up together. So it's like, I know like where they started. Cause I remember, but like people who are watching her now, you like, dang, she got this, she got that. But you forgot, like she had to start somewhere too. So that's really all I'm saying. Like you have to start somewhere. So today, that's my message to you. Like just start. Don't feel like you have to have everything together because nobody is perfect and nobody's life is perfect. No matter how good the content looks, girl, ain't nobody got it all together. So that's just what I wanted to say. But I am gonna take y'all in here with me. Girl, I'm supposed to be 25 weeks today, but Sun Sun has been measuring two weeks ahead. So I really need to find out how far I am, girl, cause I don't know, I like to keep up with that. Like I feel like if I am 25 weeks, then okay. But if I'm 27 weeks, like I need to know that. Cause more than likely I am 27 weeks. Cause he was measuring two weeks ahead, which means that if I am 27 weeks today, cause every Thursday I turn a new week. So if I am 27 weeks today, that means next week I'll be seven months. So, and then technically like you're really pregnant for like 40 weeks which is like 10 months. So yeah, your baby, even though I'm measuring two weeks ahead, um, I'm still, he's still in the, in the due date range. So girl, we gonna find out. So I'm gonna take y'all with me. I'm not gonna talk this whole vlog. I just wanted to say my little piece about that because I feel like it needed to be said. So I take y'all inside with me when it's time for me to go. I still have time. So I'm just about to chill for now. And yeah, so I thought you had guys I'm done with the appointment our little baby is growing you guys he is so active I love him so much already he's so active my blood pressure good once again we're measuring ahead girl I lost weight because I am active but that's a good thing it's not a bad thing um but little man is active and it's just a blessing. He's doing good, he's growing. He's big, she said. Um, he's growing. Sorry. So now I gotta go over to the hospital and register. It's getting close to time. We passed the halfway mark. And I'm so excited. He's, at, he's awake, always. <laughs> and everything is just going smoothly. Shout out to God, because he's a real one. Like, I'm so happy. We can't wait to meet baby Roman. And everyone loves the name. My daughter loves the name. And girl, it's almost that time. Like, I have to go um, for my last set of labs. Ooh, I'm tired, y'all. I gotta go for my last set of labs um, because we getting ready for the gestational. <laughs> diabetes um thing so i'll do that i'm gonna schedule that as early as possible so we can go ahead and get that done what else everything is going good um just so excited so i have to drive over to the hospital right now and because it's right across the street drive over to the hospital and register because we're gonna be giving birth soon so excited <laughs> so i'll let y'all later. 
Y'all, I'm so hungry. I had to run an errand for my grandma, but girl, we just at Taco Bell because I'm gonna get a quesadilla. And it's about to be so good with a Baja Blast freeze. But girl, we are hungry, okay? So let's get this food. Welcome to Taco Bell, can I have you? Hi, can I have one chicken quesadilla and a Baja Blast freeze? You want combo number seven? No, thank you. Okay, you say one chicken quesadilla and then Baja Blast freeze. Yes. What size? Um, small. Okay, that's it? Yes. Seven, seven, you come to the window. Please. Thank you. You're welcome. 